Conversations.com. EliteConversations.com. EliteConversations.com. Hello there, this is Daryl Spears with EliteConversations.com and this is another great episode of Elite Conversations Unplugged. We are excited to have you here again on another Thursday as we bring another dynamic expert and professional here with you. <laughs> Some of you might know this face, but we're excited to have Miss Cece Michaela in the house today and we're going to be talking about a wealth of things yes. in terms of what she's doing right now. You guys know about her as an excellent artist in terms of Broadway, acting, music. I mean, she's done so much and she has really tapped into her gifting and is now focusing in the area of health and nutrition and really doing some outstanding things in terms of making sure we are educated on what we can do naturally, what we can do to help yes. our bodies, to cleanse our bodies. And just talking to her offline, we have a great show <laughs> to share with you about what we can do. Uh, so again, my name is Daryl Spears and CC is here for a conference this Saturday, yes. which is going to be focused on health and nutrition. And that's always such an important um, aspect of business. As you know, this is a business show. We do a lot in terms of sharing information about uh, business in terms of the technical things, taxes, legal. We do all of that. But you know also, as business owners, sometimes we get to that place where we done stressed ourselves out, <laughs> where we're not taking the time to get rest. Of course, we're not eating right because we're running oh from no. meeting to meeting <laughs> and running from this event and that event. And we stop at, don't let say me not it, say it. Say <laughs> it. <laughs> well, I stop at that place and get that fast no. food. <laughs> and um, it's, it really is important that we really stop and think, you know, because what we're doing is good for us as a business. We're trying to create a legacy for our kids and yes. leave something for them. But our kids want to see a healthy parent, too. They exactly. want us to be around as long as we can. So thank you so much for being uh -huh. on the show. <laughs> thank you for taking the time. We're here in town and coming and sharing with us. And just talk a little bit about Cece Michaela, what you're doing right now, and share mm -hmm. with us a little bit about Zelena Cardio and just how all of that has, has come about. I know. Oh, my goodness. So, so many people do know me as the TV actress, Yvonne, yes. from the show Girlfriends. Yes, <laughs> yes, like, yes. how did you go from that to this? <laughs> right, right. But uh, health and wellness has always been a huge part of my life. Um, okay. Being in the entertainment industry many, many moons ago, mm -hmm. I um, w had the opportunity to uh, do a musical in Canada. Awesome. And uh, moved there for a while to do the show and was one of the youngest in the cast at the time. And there was one other member that was very young and I, we kind of, you know, hang t hung together and mm -hmm. she was a vegan. And I said, you're a what? <laughs> <laughs> you're a what? <laughs> yeah. And uh, she said, a vegan. And I says, well, I got to eat with somebody mm -hmm. and you're the only one in my age range. So I don't want to disrespect you. So I'll just eat the way you eat. I'm fine. It's wow. not that serious. And um, I was like, oh, gosh, you know what? Is mm -hmm. this? And I am begin to eat it, and I said, "This is this is me. Don't don't fool me." You know, like, <laughs> she's like, "No, it just tastes it like just it." Tastes I said, "She's like, I told you it wouldn't be that bad." And sure enough, um, I just began to learn what that is and to eat cleaner. Um, I'm not a vegan now. I'm incredibly balanced, okay. and that's what Zelina is all about. It is not vegan. <laughs> right. so we'll it's like clean you. eating. Okay. It's wonderful, very, very balanced, making sure you get all of your proteins, amino acids, and vitamins and minerals, very nutrient-dense mm -hmm. um, eating program along with the Zulina cardio, which is the movement and the dance side, comes okay. from the Zulu tribe, and it leans out the body. So that's where I got the name Zulina. It's okay. brand new. It's my awesome. own trademark, which awesome. is really wonderful. Um, and it's really sweeping the nation. The ladies are absolutely loving. Ladies, what about I the know. Brothers need well, the let, there's a secret you. to it. Okay. There's a method to the okay. madness. What happens is um, uh, the ladies are the dietitian of the family. Um, they're the ones that have to go shopping. Mm -hmm. uh, they're the ones that want to come together and talk. And the men, they kind of have that gym thing down. When mm -hmm. they're stressed out, like, look, babe, I'm, I'm gone. I want to pump some iron. Right, right. Women, they, they go and they eat. 
If okay. I don't know if you knew that, it's like that's their friend. When they feel bad, men are like, yo, I need to, you know, punk, mm -hmm. I just need to deal with this. And I think that's, I wish we as women knew, but we tend to, oh, I'm going to go eat this. Well, maybe if I just, you know, mm -hmm. and it shows. It's like, right, it's, right, it's, it's right, showing. Right, right. And so I wanted to co uh, come up with something to where uh, food is your friend, but it's a different type of friend that's not going to make you sick or bloated mm -hmm. or, or, you know, obese, if you will, but that actually food can work for you. And so I'm teaching them foods that harm and foods that heal. Okay. And that's what it's all about. That's what the Zulina mm -hmm. life is all about. And that's interesting, too, because, I mean, you have the food, and but the education piece is so yes. important, knowing what to eat, when Absolutely. to eat it, how to eat it. But then once you're educated, you have to have the discipline. We talked about yes. that before the show <laughs> of going and shopping and getting the right yes. thing. Yes, uh-huh. Um, and it, it costs to eat healthy. You know, sometimes, and especially in our community, yes. you know, we find ourselves in the community where it's so easy to get to McDonald's, it's so easy to yes. get to Popeyes. And, yes. And again, you can spend less than five, ten dollars and get the Happy Meal. So not right. only are you eating raw foods, but you're getting more of it as yeah. well. So you know, it's um, the toxins. Mm -hmm. Once that I really begin to teach in Zulina, it's not really a diet, it's a lifestyle. It takes a minute. In it the beginning you're like, mm -hmm. okay, tell me what I can't have. You know, you're mm -hmm. so used to that same old, mm -hmm. same old. And then I begin to teach them like, okay, let me say it to you like this. Um, imagine if you went into the grocery store and instead of seeing uh, let's say oatmeal topped with blueberries, that's one of our that's a number one breakfast for Zulina that's going to help you to lose weight. And, uh, like uh, oatmeal pushes out bad cholesterol. Okay. It just does. That's just, cholesterol cannot stand oatmeal. It's just, just going to run. It's just <laughs> not going to. And that relationship is like that. It's like, gosh, I didn't know food had such a life. They're running and moving. Wow, and wow. so w when you know that, it's like, that's amazing. That's called beta glucan, which is uh, released when you eat oatmeal. That's what it's made of is wow. beta glucan. Okay. The blueberries are polyphenols. So in, in the Zulina life, it's like, oh, I think I'm going to have a bowl of beta glucan topped with polyphenols. Wow. And that's literally wow. <laughs> how we mm -hmm. speak. And so our food literally becomes our medicine. And mm -hmm. it's not so emotional. It's not so miserable. And you're thinking weighing and calories and, and dieting. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. And there are portion controls and things like that. Right. But it is amazing to actually learn how powerful food is so these women are literally waking up and once they know they are they take care of the husband You're like mm -hmm. babe what you got a headache got you let got me go to the kitchen I know mm -hmm. what to wait I got know what to make this morning oh my baby woke up with feeling this way mm -hmm. uh, an inner ear ah I know what to go to the kitchen I know what to make in order to heal the inner ear that's um, it's amazing wow. that God did that I mean that's why Adam and Eve were in the garden Absolutely. from the very beginning they had everything, everything they that need. they needed everything from they the need. sea to the sun the sun is vitamin d3 but mm -hmm. if we don't go out in it because we're like oh, I don't want to get dark I don't want I don't really like the sun mm -hmm. well then your bones are gonna hurt because the vitamin d3 which comes from the sun's rays heals all the way to the bone yeah, so, it, I mean, it's just incredible that to learn. Incredible. And then there's a big difference in uh, walking, you know, in a contained place or maybe on the treadmill, let's mm -hmm. say in a gym, and walking on a great uh, nature trail with all these trees, you're getting lots of oxygen, so that's less lung disease. It's okay. just, Maybe Zulina's a total way of thinking. It's like it a is. new language where you're like, you just love it. It's like, you know, I'm going to go oh, walk yeah. in along the trees today just to get my lungs, get mm -hmm. some air in my lungs. Absolutely. You know, Absolutely. it's just a different way all all together, and it's just really cool to uh, to just know that um, you know iron is spinach. Most people know that, mm -hmm. or the eyes is carrots. You know, I say, what do you know? What do you know? I know yeah. you know something. I said, okay, yeah, carrots, eyes, yeah, spinach is iron, yeah. You know, yeah. you get strong. Okay. You know, spinach. I said, but what if you knew every single vegetable and every single fruit <laughs> and what it could do? And what they're like, yeah. you're kidding. I'm like, well, that's Zulina, and you don't have to really ever be sick again. You know, That's awesome. it's pretty That's cool. Awesome. So, uh, again, this is a business show, and sure. I know those that look at the show are business owners and entrepreneurs, and we have just a different lifestyle. You know, <laughs> I mean, yes. My question is, what can I eat? Because um, my wife does a good job, you know, in the in the main meals and the meals during the day. Right. But when I'm up at two o'clock in the oh morning. No. And that craving <laughs> you gotta come get on. Your sleep. <laughs> yeah, well, I try to do I that too. I know what you're but, saying. I know what you're you know, saying. And yeah. you want to go get that meal. Or, and, and on the other side of that too, when I'm out during the day, yes. and I know that I'm not going to be back home for 
eight, nine hours. Yes. What should I pack? How sh what should I be taking with me to get me through the day Absolutely. and make sure that I don't fall off the track? Because right. I'll pull in the McDonald's no. in a heartbeat. <laughs> I think it is. And it's true. No, and, and Zulina is definitely on mm -hmm. the go. I tour. I'm, uh, I'm mm -hmm. touring the nation right now with Zulina. Um, and it's, it stays the same. And there's mm -hmm. wonderful, what I call them, Zulina approved restaurants. Hopefully, I will actually work on that and get that on the menu where you'll be able to see, like, oh my gosh, the, the Zulina seal is on the door. Oh man, the meals are. Nice. Oh, I'm working on it. <laughs> nice. I mean, this is a big, this is a pretty big deal. It's a serious okay. thing because I'm planning to have so many women that talk to the men who, mm -hmm. the men are getting into it. The children is spilling off into the children and you basically have these Zulina families and uh, it's just gonna be a blessing to all of the restaurants to be like, oh yeah, we're Zulina approved. Just open up the menu. You don't even have to think about it. Gotcha. Anything that says Zulina, you can order it and it fits right within her lifestyle, which means that's, you know, anti-disease, anti-cancer, you know, it's got the red grapes rather than the green grapes, things of that nature. And so um, there are, when you, when you go to the website, mm -hmm. um, and you're able to do a consultation with me, very, very affordable, and it's customized. And that's when this little box here mm -hmm. <laughs> comes nice. to your door. Uh, this one particularly is called the Milk Belly Fat Kit. That is, of course, America's favorite. <laughs> Ding, awesome, ding, ding. Awesome, awesome. <laughs> because uh, there is, we do have a, a belly fat problem in America. Yeah, Everybody's yeah, got absolutely. a pouch, a muffin top, or a, a, something going on. Mm -hmm. And of course, a lot of the diseases lie in the belly. Um, so this is a three-piece kit. Uh, but you can really, it's about 47 different products wow. that you Isn't can, it? no, 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 that, oh, like, they, it comes bigger, they come in all these <laughs> like different sizes, stupid. yeah, okay. but it's custom to you when you go on there, uh, it could oh, be headaches, uh, and you're thinking, that's normal for me, no, that's magnesium citrate deficiency, it's $5, tastes mm -hmm. like raspberry lemonade, it's just that simple, it's like, oh. My goodness. So if we, you're able to add that. Mm -hmm. If it's menopause, we have that. It's five dollars. Wow. You know, you're thinking, I thought hot flashes, you don't, mm -hmm. it, it doesn't have to be. But we don't have a lot of pre-care. We don't have any aftercare. That, mm -hmm. Zulina is about all of that, kind of taking care of the stages of life instead of just life happening. <laughs> okay. You can prepare. So, you know, you don't have to have hot flashes, but I, people think that's the reality. That's yeah. They've that's never that's heard that you mm -hmm. can eat in a way that cools the body several months out and several years out to where when it comes, it, it just apps, you've, eat, eat, you've eaten so many cooling foods and that comes out of India. So a lot of my medicine, that technique comes out of India. So see, wow. it's, it's, tr uh, it's TCM, traditional Chinese medicine, Ayurvedic medicine is out of India. And I'm that girl, I'm the medicine hunter, mm -hmm. where I've kind of studied these natural uh, ways of, of thinking and, and, and learning and, and God built the whole universe. It's just that you've got to have access to it. Wow. You got to tap into it and be like, wow, you know, like turmeric. I think most people, or turmeric, people say mm -hmm. it differently. Right, exactly. That's a yellow powder. If you've ever eaten Indian, you've already eaten it. Eaten it. Wow. You know, you're like, yeah, that's the yellow, yeah, right. you know. But that's anti-cancer. It makes it so cancer can't even move if mm -hmm. you did have it. It's a liver cleanse and it's anti-inflammatory and anti-pain. Anytime you hear mm -hmm. itis, that's inflammation. Inflammation, inflammation. Okay. yeah. yeah. Wow. So it's things like that. We have the spices mm -hmm. on Zulina, 24 mm -hmm. herbs and spices. Um, we have, um, uh, all of the different amino acids, um, algaes, vitamins, minerals, a lot of things are just a vitamin deficiency. You know, some people say, I'm gonna just do the egg whites. I'm very balanced. I said, no, put a little yolk in there. Yep, it'll, be, okay. it'll be okay. Mm -hmm. How, how's your cholesterol? If it's mm -hmm. not too bad, just a little bit of the yolk. Why it has choline. What does choline do? Very good at um, emotional balance. Okay. Now awesome. why should you be on emotional medicine and this and that? When you're like, I just don't eat eggs. Yeah, I'm like, yeah. see, it's what you eat and mm -hmm. what you don't eat. And what you don't eat. Wow, yeah. Isn't wow, that something? Wow. <laughs> like you are what so you eat and you are what you don't you, eat. Right. So you have the product here. Now, where do individuals go to get the education knowledge? Sure. Of what is that on the website? It's Taste all on the website. People? Yeah. So it's, it's, it's particularly this one is www.zulina dot com z u l e a n a with the word lean right lean. there in the mean it leans out the body zulina yeah and okay. uh the www.imcc which is my name mm -hmm. it all goes to the same website so it makes it very easy awesome yeah. awesome awesome <laughs> so guys we are talking to miss cc michaela a lot of you guys know her from uh tv shows from uh girlfriends, girlfriends yes and, uh, broadway and we just thank you for sharing some of uh, this great new um, product that can benefit each and every one of us. So I really appreciate that. And um, 
we're going to talk a little bit more about the product and how individuals can find it um, as the show goes on. I want you to talk a little bit about my Zoe girls, my Zoe Green girls, and I mean, you 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 really have you know a passion for health, but you also have a passion for helping young ladies, yes. young girls find their place in society in a way that that brings you know um, brings them in a the, in a good sure. light and not in a way of you know what things happen in the culture, but right. having them have good self esteem for yes. themselves, understand who they are as strong women, and that's something that we need to make sure we do with a lot that's going on. So talk a little bit about the book, about what you're doing in terms of um, the young ladies mm -hmm. and, and all of that good stuff with oh, uh, Zoe Green Oh, they're Girls. so sweet. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Zoe Green um, is, it actually started uh, when I lived in a beautiful town called Greenville, South okay. Carolina. Very, very quaint, beautiful Main Street there, um, like no other that I've ever seen. And as nice. I was walking down that particular uh, street, um, uh, it, it was just fascinated me. Mm -hmm. And I said, what if I was a little girl walking down the street? This would just be amazing. I said, you know what? I'm going to really focus on the, wor the color green. Wow. Okay. <laughs> um, and it, it's a very healthy color. You know, you've got green smoothies. And mm -hmm. in my product line, I have green soap. I have green toothpaste. Everything is so natural that it's no added dyes or gotcha. colors. It's left in its natural color, which usually if it's from a plant and it's herbal, then it's green. Mm -hmm. <laughs> mm -hmm. And green is a wonderful last name. And so I decided to co call her Zoe Green. Zoe, um, of course, means life. Uh, and green is the color of prosperity and health. Mm -hmm. So she definitely is a little girl, a little beautiful little, um, she's actually uh, mixed with black and Asian. I wanted her to be very unusual and mm -hmm. different and just, you know, mixed and, gotcha. and that type of thing, very universal. Um, and I, I, I held an audition to try to find the perfect wow. Zoe Green. And I couldn't do it. I found 12 <laughs> perfect <laughs> Zoe Greens. So I decided to have take all of the children and let um, each one of them have their own page gotcha. um, and become Zoe Green. And so it's a very different type of children's book in that when you're looking at the book, it looks like a very beautifully illustrated book, but those are actual real pictures mm. that I took, me and my husband, myself, wow, ourselves. Awesome, we took awesome. it and we turned it into animation. And so some of the girls are dark, light, medium. And I wanted to pick girls who had beautiful imperfections, like the gap in the teeth. Mm. I look mm -hmm. for things like that like specifically. That, exactly. okay. Yeah, um, a coily hair, kinky mm -hmm. hair, um, very, very light freckles, things okay. that they were thinking, right. what about me? Exactly. But that you would never find yourself, you know, in a book. A black girl has freckles? Mm -hmm. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. well, why come I have a gap in the teeth and other people? Well, honey, that's a beautiful tribe that has the gap in the teeth. You didn't, that's not an imperfection. That actually is a beautiful mark to let you know what tribe you come from. Mm -hmm. And she was like, Wow. <laughs> and so not only are you learning how to uh, drink smoothies and and, uh, you know, natural hygiene for the for the little girls and things like that, but you're learning your culture. One of the things that Zoe Green loves to do is she loves to jump rope. Oh, yeah. And, you know, <laughs> we're 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 we're, yeah, we're missing culture, that yeah, now. We, we did. I did an yeah. audition. I gave him a rope. A lot of them were like. What do I do with it? I, 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 they knew how to dance. They kn could do video games, right. you know, um, but they didn't know how to jump rope. And I said, in the midst of me trying to audition just to do a book, I couldn't leave them. I said, you know what? Not only am I going to do this book, we are going to do an exercise, movement, dance, and performing arts and humanities program for you while I'm writing this book. Why not make the book come to life? And and, and, and we're going to just make the book come to life. That's what we're going to do. We're gonna, I'm going to write a musical for you. And it's like, it's a Zoe Green life. Okay. And it's just wow. adorable, you wow. know. And they, it talks about recycling, saving the earth, hygiene, how, you know, beautiful my skin is. And, oh, I love my curly hair. And just, mm -hmm. you know, things that you normally don't, you would normally not hear. Mm -hmm. They had to learn how to jump rope, double dutch. <laughs> you know, we're, we're, we're losing that. We are. And in the book, it actually teaches them um, that the Egyptians were the, were the very first people to jump rope a uh, vine and bamboo. And then, of course, uh, the Europeans, uh, particularly Dutch, mm -hmm. came and took of course, you know, capture the African, mm -hmm. the Africans, Middle Passage came, and of course landed in America. They, of course, learned how to do so, mm -hmm. the, the jumping from the Egyptians and from the Africans. Thereby, you have double Dutch. Wow. Double Dutch double from Dutch. the Dutch from right. Denmark. Yeah. Wow. So, and so it, the book really brings you full circle, and it just makes them feel so proud to mm -hmm. be like, 
that's something we did from the very beginning and yet here we are over here and we've lost it. Mm -hmm. So it makes them want to go back. I said, yeah, do you know we were some of the most beautiful jumpers. We were the first jumpers mm -hmm. of rope in the whole world, yeah. you know, and they're like, wow, oh, I gotta do it. I just gotta do it. <laughs> yeah, it's true. I mean, you walk out the house and it was jumping rope all yes, over the place and playing yes. and hopscotch and all that Absolutely. Stuff, you know, that so we do a lot of that in Zoe good. Green. And the beautiful thing is she will travel. So we definitely are going to be looking to do, you know, Zoe Green in North Carolina, Zoe Green, mm -hmm. D.C., mm -hmm. actually building um, the company of girls who do want to learn um, the art, the performing arts, humanities, okay. etiquette, and, and fitness. So I th it's a beautiful, beautiful program. So it started out in Greenville, and I'm definitely looking to expand the Zoe Green girls. Absolutely. That's <laughs> excellent. That's excellent. So one of the things I, um, with EliteConversations.com, one of our three pillars are to provide knowledge, resources, and those connections. Great. Um, so I wanted to sort of have you just share a little bit about your process and your career and the things you've mm -hmm. done because I know those Zoe Green girls are looking at you <laughs> and have seen the work you've done on Broadway and there are a lot of girls out there that have aspirations to do things and young men that are, have Absolutely. aspirations to do things and what are some of the core values that you have mm -hmm. and some of the things that you can share with those that might be listening sure. or watching the video. Um, and even when I'm teaching the Zoe mm -hmm. Green girls um, uh, today or when I'm mentoring uh, you know young girls in college at HBCUs and mm -hmm. things like that I tell them to stay teachable mm -hmm. stay teachable <laughs> and it's yeah. sometimes it's hard because you you get to the point where you're like oh I know I know this I already know I'm like no you don't know everything you can't mm -hmm. know everything stay teachable read read and then when you think you've read enough read some more <laughs> yeah. Yeah, sure. I also tell them if you're not reading a book write a book so that's what I say, hey, you guys, if I'm not reading a book, I'm writing a book. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's important to record your history. We have not always had a chance to do that. Mm -hmm. And then especially as far as a woman or a girl is concerned, uh, because I do come from, uh, you know, a Bible-based, uh, mm -hmm. you know, uh, type of life, of course, um, only two women made it into the Bible. And that's the best history that I think <laughs> <laughs> exists. Right. And so I say, do you understand the opportunity you have now? What is your name? It's mm -hmm. not just Esther and Ruth. What is your name? Mm -hmm you have the opportunity. Yeah, sure. They didn't. Mm -hmm. So, you know, and only two made it that where they could actually have, you know, a, the name in a book. Yeah, well, so right. what is your story? Mm -hmm. And if, 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 and I know for me, I'm nothing uh, without, you know, Esther or Ruth. Mm -hmm. They were so influential in just my, my single life, my married life. Mm -hmm. I go back to the Bible all the time mm -hmm. to find out what to do as a woman. Mm -hmm. You know, it doesn't matter what it is. It is, it's, it's there's nothing new under the sun, right? <laughs> so, and true. so I teach them that there's nothing new. I know, well, you don't understand. Mm, yes, I do. <laughs> there's nothing new <laughs> under the sure. sun. Yeah. And so I teach them that lesson as well. And that uh, it's already, we've already been there, done that. And it's already in, in, in from the beginning of time, it's already written in the word. And the word works. Um, faith without works is dead. Absolutely. So uh, you can work, work, work all, all you right. want, but without faith, then you can't please God and you have nothing. Mm -hmm. And so those two work hand in hand. And so, um, you know, there's a lot of people who are really working very, very hard, very, very but hard. their faith level mm -hmm. is just like this, you know. And the, you know what? God is good because He gives everybody a measure. But what you want to work on or anyone wants to work on is building, building, building right. the, making that measure go wider and wider and really stepping out and knowing really God has your back. It may not be easy. Mm -hmm. You know, you may fall, get back up, get try back it up. again. Absolutely. I think about 409 and people don't, you know, the spray, mm -hmm. the cleansing spray, it literally took that person 409 tries oh, before they actually could yeah. get it right yeah you know so it's it's thing I think it's Heinz 57 it took them 57 times to get the formula to taste exactly but I mean can you imagine you know stopping after five or seven or eight like okay this is not working out I mean who's yeah. to say that 57 is too much too little you know what I mean exactly. I'm sure it you know 20, 20 it's like babe you, you are you still shaking that bottle babe you still trying to taste are you serious yeah. and those type of stories um, examples it gives me hope it lets me know like man when you have something when God gave you so you better stick you to it, it until I mean what if Noah would have given up on the ark Absolutely. people call him crazy and he's like well I, all I know is I've got the dimensions and nobody else seems to be moving on this <laughs> so, and, and and it gets me I, I'm one of those that um, I'm, I'm kind of called to do very unusual mm -hmm. kind of big 
projects that I do wonder, like, who was supposed to do this? Like, I'm just the one that has enough faith that I'm the to willing vessel <laughs> to do it. Right. But who was really supposed to do this? And yet I think mm -hmm. of Noah, and he will give you the instructions. If he gives you the vision, he'll give you the provision. Mm -hmm. and, and, and the thing about it I think that's hard is um, waiting on God's timing and not flipping out that it doesn't happen overnight. Absolutely. Do you know what I mean? Absolutely. And, and yeah, many, many things have to marinate yeah, really absolutely. good. Let it marinate and let God release it. And, and it is tough because in your own mind, you're thinking it's been three years. I guess it, I thought it was dead. Mm -hmm. I think. And he, he is a redeemer of time and he is the great resurrector. Yeah, That's absolutely. what he does so well. So sometimes when I'm doing something and it kind of sits, I say, Lord, now I don't want it to. Um, Hope you don't think I'm kind of, he's like, no, it's, it's pretty cool. I'm gonna let you know when to bring it back out again. And we tweak it, we'll shake it off a little bit. And but I just needed you to get that found. I'm like, okay, I got the foundation yeah, ready. Absolutely. Let me know when you're ready to absolutely. pull it up and shake it out a little right. bit. So yeah, those are some of the principles. The, the foundation is just so important in making sure you build that. And I think about the bamboo tree, people don't realize it takes four and a half years. You have to water it every day for four and a half mm. years and you don't see anything. Then all of a sudden, that Bunch. last day, boom, it grows like 90 feet in like 30 days. It's just unbelievable. I know. But that, if you're not amazing. faithful and watering it every day, mm. you know, so it's we amazing. have to be in that place of being willing to stop and listen and wait. So I like that a lot. Yeah. We appreciate all you have done, the information you have provided. Before we go, I want you to share a little bit about what's going to take place on Saturday. We have a great event coming up, what you'll be doing there. I'm sure you have your product there. You'll be talking a little yes. bit more about Zulina, Zulina African Cardio. Um, what is, what's going to take place Saturday in terms of what folks can expect when they come out to the event? Yeah, uh, Sheree Good mm -hmm. uh, actually invited me in. I'm just so grateful mm -hmm. for her. It's the seventh annual, I believe, uh, mm -hmm. Get Serious. I think it's Health, Wellness, Which and Fitness this. Expo. Mm -hmm. Very, that just is me, me, me. It's a win, win, win mm -hmm. <laughs> for me. Awesome. Um, but it is free. It's going to be wonderful. It's at the Doubletree mm -hmm. um, Hilton Hotel. Um, and uh, I, I just love the fact that it's going to be lots of demos lots mm -hmm. of all types of exercise all types of um, of uh, you know you can get all types of blood work mm -hmm. checked and um, you know get things you know bl uh, blood pressure you know all, all types of stuff. things mm -hmm. checked out um, which is just wonderful because we need to be in the know knowledge is power um, and it's all free and that's what's really really wonderful and for somebody like me where it's really unusual and different like whoa, African cardio, <laughs> what's that? So it's kind of fun to be kind of the new kid on the block, <laughs> mm -hmm. so that's to awesome. speak, and to have something uh, that's my very own coming out of Africa, um, but having such a wonderful track record already of, of literally about a thousand or so women who have lost um, massive amounts of weight in a short period of time, very safe, um, and are keeping it off mm -hmm. awesome. um, through natural medicine, not weird pills or a crazy diet, but just nutrient dense mm -hmm. foods and having the knowledge of what foods harm yeah, and what mm -hmm. foods heal. So I will have my booth there and I'm excited to go visit all the other booths that are going to be coming and, and partaking um, in some of their products mm -hmm. awesome. and services um, that they're going to have. Um, I think there's even financial okay. wellness, of course, that's going to be there because of course that all affects the body it and does. the fitness, you know, exactly. financially fit, physically yeah. fit, exactly. you know. So it's a little bit of everything, something no for everybody. No bills, no medicine down the road. Yes. You know, I always say even personally, you mm -hmm. can't be rich but sick, and you mm -hmm. can't be uh, wealthy but unhealthy. Mm -hmm. It just doesn't work. Yeah, <laughs> it's, it's not a good place. Well, thank you again so much. I want you to take one minute and share again how individuals can get your product, how they can uh, learn more about just getting healthy sure. themselves in terms of your website. How can individuals reach you? Oh, absolutely. Well, uh, my name is Cece Michaela, mm -hmm. and the best thing to do is just to go to my website, mm -hmm. www.imcc.com. That's C-E-E-C-E-E.com. Uh, hit the shop button, <laughs> and it's 47 of my favorite products, even natural nail polishes on there, oh, wow. all the way to the top dark chocolate that you should uh, that you should uh, you know eat um, because you know you you do have you know that you right. get those times <laughs> where you just want a little mm -hmm. something so it's something a little better. it's a little something for everybody but yeah once again or you can I'll go to zulina.com z u l e a n a zulina.com and I'm touring all over so look for the pop up classes I actually pop up in in various cities oh, and okay. people can sign up and experience African Zulina cardio I call out the different countries in Africa and you're actually going to be learning the beautiful movement 
movements of those different tribes. And it just works beautifully, especially on the African American body, because we it's something I think we've just, you know, kind mm -hmm. of been pulled away from and just didn't even know we naturally knew how to Zulu kick mm -hmm. or uh, do the neck rolls or shoulders like the Eritrea or the mm -hmm. people from Ethiopia. Right. So you learn a lot of culture, actually, and a lot of African history while losing weight and sweating out toxins. <laughs> yep. And we need to be moving. You know, movement is move. a key. You know, it is. Sends, you know, we're so sedentary and stationary now. Yes. That's the new cigarette. You know, yeah. it, it really is yeah. causing a lot of disease if you're not moving and active. Yeah. So when they that's go to huge. The, when they go to the website, one of the things that I've been hearing lately is they're, sh they're very surprised at the women. They're all sizes. Oh I yeah, deal with absolutely. women two, three, four, up to 500 mm -hmm. pounds. And I deal with women uh, that are, uh, it's almost like a cancer survivors. They're doing cancer aftercare, lupus, fibromyalgia. They're like, do I see people with, with a brace on? Or mm -hmm. You can actually sit. There's mm -hmm. a sit sitting component mm -hmm. of uh, Af a Zulina African cardio where awesome. you're sitting awesome. and you're learning how to uh, strengthen um, the knees if you have a knee problem. You have the knee, you know, you can sit and you can do the arm mm -hmm. circles. Absolutely. You can still do. Some of us are standing and doing that move. Some of them are sitting, sitting. but they're moving. They're like, gotcha. hey, and they're sitting in the so it's called chair. Yeah. It's called Zulina, you know, sit down chair. And they're still doing the movements, mm -hmm. but they're, they're able to sit and support their back and they're moving those arms and they're moving the waist. If we're, you know, that if okay. we're up moving, they're kind of still, still okay. sitting and, and they're, they're, they're like, wow, I just okay. never thought to, I didn't know I, I could move in the chair. Right, I just, you know, right, you just right. hear like, I can't walk. And you're thinking, I got my knee. I'm mm -hmm. like, I know that knee, but let's get those that's arms. Let's else. get, you know, get it going. So wow. that's exciting to be able to be in a class where some of them are sitting, some of them are standing um, and things like that. It's a, it's a very different type of, of, of class. Um, and it's good to see the three and four hundred pounds mm -hmm. that you too can mm -hmm. move, but you've got to do it at your own pace. So I am a coach, actually, a natural health coach, good. as well as a fitness coach. So I do come around and make sure of your proper form. You got to let me know if mm -hmm. you have any problems. I'm like, okay, on my back, back aches over here, my knee. <laughs> knees over here what, what we got what we got we put them in the areas and they uh, I actually modify it for them so it's wonderful so uh, so I've already been to Atlanta and I'm heading up to New York and I'm awesome. going over to Louisiana nice. so it's okay. yeah it's moving around it's literally a the Zulina cardio tour okay excellent <laughs> well we have had a great opportunity to hear from Miss Cece Michaela the CEO and owner and founder and creator of uh, Zulina Africa uh, cardio Definitely look out for her to come to your city. As she just said, there's no excuse. You can do it in the chair, yes. you can do it standing, <laughs> you can do it running, however you want to do it. But health is the key. Health is important. Stay in, move, uh, stay in movement, in motion, and eating right. That's, That's right. the key. Yeah, get your Finally, consultation. Get the consultation, <laughs> eat the right on thing. The website. Yes. So for us as business owners, we can continue to do the things that the, that we've been called to do, use our gifts the way God has called us to use our gifts and really take advantage of creating an environment, a legacy for our kids. So yeah. thank you for joining Elite Conversations Unplugged. Again, we appreciate you for always supporting us every Thursday. Again, my name is Daryl Spears. You can find out more about our show on EliteConversations.com and you can definitely find out more information about Miss Cece Michaela there as well and all the great resources and information and product that she has to offer. So thank you for joining us again and you have a great evening. Thank you so much. Oh, thanks for having me. It was Excellent. wonderful. Excellent. Appreciate that. Bye-bye. <laughs>